no matter what you ride on the street when it comes from the factory the gearing is set up to do its job what does that job mean well for marketing terms that you have a good top speed for rideability issues that the bike can drive along relatively speaking without being awful at low rpms and then suddenly being a light switch at high rpms so those are the two principal things that the bike comes to you with when you ride the bike the questions become realistically based on the engine size what gears can you use in your regular environment so if you're around town and you're commuting and you're on the freeway the gearing will give you so many miles per gallon based on the configuration and your engine rpm and of course where you sit speed wise so looking at that particular environment what if you were to increase the size of the front sprocket and then decrease the size of the rear sprocket catch the full podcast at davemostuning.com